Father, we acknowledge you. How great you are, how marvelous. How gentle, how meek, how tender, how perfect, how great, how awesome, how excellent, how majestic. Thank you. 
it of you to see me through today. Through, to see me through tonight, to take me through tomorrow. I will wait. I will patiently wait. I will wait to make my next move. I will wait for the next plan, the next instruction. I will wait upon me. For in failing to wait is my displeasure. In waiting, in failing to wait upon you are my errors, disaster, and even destruction. Teach me to wait. Even in the time when I'm in the fire, I need to learn how to wait. On the right time to get out of the fire. I should not get out of the fire because of the flames or even because of the burn. But I should get out of the fire because that's your will. If it is your will to remain in the fire much longer, then Father, it means that you have a better plan and a perfect will for me to be tried and processed by the fire. But so often, because of the burning flames, we flee the fire, the fire, thereby fleeing the process that should have processed us into pure gold. We move by the dictates of life the dictates of our flesh, the dictates of this world, and we don't wait upon you, we don't seek your will, teach us to wait, wait for the right moment, the right word, from your lips, for your words are perfect, there's no flaws, no error, no mistakes in your words. Teach me to wait. Teach us tonight to wait. Because as we wait, the process of wait burns off the ego that drives us the impulses that pushes us often time in the wrong direction teach me to wait teach me to wait Lord we come to this place tonight and the first thing we're going to do is wait we're going to wait upon you for your visitation we're going to wait upon you for your presence we're going to wait upon you for your words we're going to wait upon you for your blessings we're going to wait upon you for your anointing we're going to wait upon you lord god for all that you have willed for us tonight we shall wait we will wait patiently for they that wait upon the lord shall renew their strength they shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall run and they shall not be weary. They shall also walk. They never shall faint. We're going to wait. There are many things we would like to see change. There are many things we would like to see better and different. But Father, tonight, we say to you very humbly and very reverently, teach us to wait. Wait upon the Lord. Oh, if everyone would just stand with me. If everyone would just be so kind to just stand with me. With your eyes closed. Prayer is asking the Lord to teach you how to wait. 